published, 159 EDT, the 9th of April 2018, updated, 803 EDT, the 9th of April 2018. Tracy Emin has claimed that she was sexually assaulted by a fellow well-known female artist. Tracy Emin has claimed that she was sexually assaulted by a fellow well-known female artist. The Turner Prize winner, 54, from Surrey said her attacker grabbed her crotch and pinned her against a wall at a party. Ms. Emin, who is renowned for her autobiographical and confessional artwork, admitted she threatened to punch her lights out following the incident. Speaking to Kenny Goss in a series of interviews to mark the artist being honored by MTV's Staying Alive Foundation at their E-Define event in Dallas this week, she said. The irony is it happened to be a woman that grabbed hold of my crotch slammed me against a wall and I threatened to punch her lights out, I grabbed hold of her dot everybody said you can't do that because she was a famous artist, I was much younger and said, yeah, I can, she can't touch me like that apostrophe dot it's the same thing, what's the difference if it's a woman's doing it, or a man doing it? If it's someone in a higher position of power or someone who thinks they're going to get away with it because of who they are, that's what the problem is. The revelations were published in The Sun today. Ms. Emin did not name her attacker. Last month Emin hit the headlines with her new public artwork in the heart of the Sydney. More than 60 handmade bronze bird sculptures have been perched on poles, awnings and above doorways along the city's bridge and Grosvenor streets as part of Emin's work The Distance of Your Heart. Emin, whose best-known pieces include 1998's My Bed, an unmade bed that represented four days in her life when she contemplated suicide, says she did not censor herself in devising the new installation for Sydney, offending people however, was far from her mind. Last month Emin hit the headlines with her new public artwork in the heart of the Sydney We Would I Want to Do Something Public Which Would Offend People? There's no point in doing that, she said at the launch of her artwork on March 21st. I want to do something for people that makes them feel good and a little tiny bird will make you stop, make you think and make you smile. My work is highly controversial, but not intentionally. It's what I do and when it is, it is, and when it isn't, it isn't. This isn't. 